All right, so this is a suggestion via Patreon. The name of the song is Been Broke. This is coming from the artist Toby in Wigway featuring Fat, Two Chains, and Chameleon Air, guys. Listen, if you guys are new here, please like and subscribe. The more that you like this content, the more that I know that you specifically would like to see more of this specific type of content, okay? Let's go ahead and just um, jump into this immediately. Now listen, so I'm, I'm definitely super hyped about this song, I generally encounter, uh, well, how about this? Every time I've encountered Toby in Wigway, it's been it's amazing. No complaints, <laughs> right? Um, so this one here, I expect to be great. Guys, Chameleonaire, though? Um, haven't heard you in a while, bro. But um, I thought he stopped doing music and, and like jumped into business or something. Um, but either way, we're here. Let's jump into it. Let's also pull up some lyrics while we can. I swear I've been broke way too long. Oh, 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 oh. All right, lyrics to pull up just in case we need them. Broke my whole life, now money right. I've been broke my whole life, now money right. I've been broke my whole life, now money right. I've been broke my whole life. Guys, I definitely love his aesthetic. Like for the most part, his videos are always like these muted, like earth tone type of things, right? Um, this one is a. Similar to that, right? Uh, definitely muted colors. Either way, let's let's uh, continue. You say government, put my pipe in my wife, right into the covenant, and pistol right by my side, contemplate dumping it. Only if a demon tries scheming or touch me. Ooh, yeah. Pit drip on me, don't trip, my slip down hydro plane. Ooh, yeah. Whole squad ball so hard on God, my buy road game. Ooh, yeah. I love buddy, make it out the muddy, still got his family intact. Ooh, yeah. Trouble. <laughs> I like this shot, guys, right? Um, I think aesthetically it's a dope shot. Um, I have no idea how they're able to actually keep that money, um, like floating the way it is. Um, but these people are really not frozen. The one, the woman in the background, actually, one of them, if you guys watch the video on your own, right? Um, one of them is literally moving slightly during the scene here, guys. Um, the song itself sounds amazing, though. No, com no complaints at all. Ooh, yeah. I love, but it make it out the muddy, still got a family intact. Ooh, yeah. Trouble us might get your whole job buttoned up like a chin strap. Ooh, every bar present gift wrap. Ooh, flow water, get a swim cap. Ooh, can't feel this big cap. Low key, I deserve a big deal, cause I've been <laughs> Like, if you don't feel this, big cap. Exactly. You're going to feel this. I mean, how could you not? Um, his music is infectious, right? Um, I have no idea why he's not larger than he is, though. Um, I have no idea. Seriously. It d doesn't make any sense, right? Uh, you have all of, like, like, the biggest named celebrities that are out there right now, literally, sharing his music. But for some reason, he's not being thrown into the algorithm. Um... It befuddles me, honestly. Let's continue. Broke my whole life. Now money right. I've been broke my whole life. Now money right. I've been broke my whole life. I got a pole in the phantom, codeine in the orange phantom. I ain't going back to being broke no more. Ain't shrimp, they shift with a pole dance. I'm vicious all my life. I serve fiends, manifestate my dreams. All right, so listen, really quickly. Um, Two Chains as of right now does not really fall into the overall um, theme, basically, that uh, that Toby and Wigway normally brings, right? Um, he's kind of promoting debauchery. Just, just, you know, just a little bit, right? You know, pole in the phantom, okay. All right. Well, I think that, that probably fits in a little bit because, you know, Toby and Weiwei generally talks about uh, protecting his family consistently. So why would two chains not? All right. Um, a stripper life mentality. He did mention that also. The slight double entendre based on the pole and the strippers and et cetera. But um, 
Thanks. Here for the pole dance, my bitch is all my life. I serve fiends, manifestate my dreams. And an Asian made these jeans, your rose in my pocket. Shout out my amigo, he the psychic. Yeah, yeah. flow like a pox. I'm talking German engineer. African American, I need some therapy. I just need someone to listen. All right. Gave her the D like a piston. She make a wish in the. Gave her the D like a piston. Think about what a piston generally does. Like think like visualize what a piston does. He gave her the D like a piston. Also double entendre, Detroit Pistons, I think, is that what they call themselves. I have no idea about sports, but I'm pretty sure Detroit has a team called the Pistons or Pistols or or something like that, right? So definitely double entendre. That's the reference to that, guys. Also, he gave his, his you know, either way. I need some therapy. Gonna... I just need someone to listen. Gave with a D like a piston. She make a wish in the Rolls Royce because stars in the ceiling. Who made a heart? Wish she wished on a star because the, the ceiling of Rolls Royce. Some Rolls Royces have those like uh those fake like sparkly things on the ceiling like stars so he so she wished on a star um all right guys we got bars two chains dropping bars today guys able to d like a piston she make a wish in the road work of stars in the ceiling who made a hard swap ebt for cash like trading cards all right Oh love, Ace Town Texan, always be investing, coming through dripping and soft. Sin, I'ma keep shining like Ice Man, Nick Trey, Flip Slim, Bugger and Paws. Grin, ever heard him say the money talks? Yeah, I'm the one doing the most talking. Oh, rule number one is get money. Number two, heard him say the money talks? Yeah, I'm the one doing the most talking. Rule number one is get money. Number two is get money. R.I.P. the Young Dog. Finn, R.I.P. Everything black on black. Yeah, Amex, melanated dark skin. Y'all run into the major label like you think they gonna sell you. Who you think that is, Clark? Oh, he's flexing his money, bro. Black Amex. He says everything's black on black. All right, so he's saying that uh, obviously he has black cards, right? So his black card, oh, then also him, his melanated dark skin, which is brown, but we're gonna call it black for, um, you know, because we call it black. Either way, um, so black on black. We're here, we're here. I mean, listen, Chameleon Air, I wasn't really a fan of his music. It was very, it was too poppy for me, you know, back in the day when he came out, right? Um, but I, but what I do respect about him is that he was able to capitalize, right, on that specific moment in his life, right? And turn his future around drastically. Uh, and unfortunately, not a lot of rappers take that, uh, you know, to heart, right? They, they, they get their first, like, you know, little bit of money, right? Um, and compared to what they could be making, it's a little bit of money, right? So um, they get their first little bit of money and then they blow it on something that promotes their their image rather than helps them financially for the future. I don't know, it's weird, guys. Either way. Get money, number two is get money. R and the young dog, Finn. Everything black on black. Yeah, Amex, melanated dark skin. Y'all run into the major label like you think they gonna sell you. Who you think that is, Clark? I am not seven, not three, not two, not eight. I'm nine above top ten. Could have been a one hit wonder. You should wonder why I ain't in the situation, y'all. Exactly, sir. Exactly. I'm not wondering. See, because I mean, for the most part, I kind of knew what was going on behind the scenes. Like, there are a couple of artists who, um, who absolutely have done this. You may not recognize them any longer, right? But they were smart enough to use that money for like the future, right? Um, and some artists were able to invest large portions of their money into things that would future proof them, right? And their families create some type of generational wealth rather than continuing on the same cycle of nonsense with um, all types of debaucherous uh, things, guys. I mean, there's really no, what's, what's the real reason why you need that gigantic chain, bro? Is it for you or is it to for someone else? Has no value. I mean, uh, well, no, it has value, but potentially. But what is it? Is that an asset? Think about that for a second, guys. Or liability. I will call, how about this? I would call that type of stuff liabilities, right? Because at any moment, you know, hip hop culture would dictate that someone's going to try to snatch your chain, bro. You don't want to get your chain snatched. So that in, inherently is putting your life in danger. It's liability, bro, right? It has no benefit to you, uh, actually, right? Yeah, put yourself back into chains, bro. Don't say you who you think that is, Clark Kent. I am not seven, not three, not two, not eight. I'm nine above top ten. Could have been a one hit wonder. You should wonder why I ain't in the situation, y'all. Broke my whole life. Uh. Now money right. Yeah. Broke my whole life. Yeah. Now 
Guys, super talented. I mean, the beat itself was dope. Again, I definitely super attracted to the aesthetic that he delivers in terms of his, uh, like, the visuals, right? Um, and the song itself is fire. No complaints. Uh, I think they all delivered very well. Uh, 2 Chain surprised me with some of these bars, right? Um, Chameleon Air just decided to rap again just to rap again, bro? I mean, that's basically where I'm at with his verse specifically. But um, his verse was probably the most, uh, like, poignant to me, right? Um, because he is literally giving you the blueprint to not be a statistic, bro, right? Follow his lead, absolutely, right? Um, but all right, listen, let me know in the comments of, uh, if I should be checking out any more of his music, and I will get into that as soon as I possibly can, all right? Listen, you guys all have an absolutely amazing day. Enjoy it thoroughly.